All right, this is going to go ahead and close this out. It seems that you are grasping the information quite well, so that was the whole objective. This is what has been newly revealed to me. I've been showing you these symbols of the two fours, okay? That's the 44. Many of you are seeing it all over the place. Now, we've talked about what this is all about in depth. Now, I ended up showing you the representation of the two divisions of knowledge and I've told you that that was fact and faith that gives us these two F's unbelievably so when we mirror, mirror these two F's I was showing you this symbol here now there's more to this symbol here that if we were going to mirror it times four we would end up getting this cross here if you will or the four squares of Freemasonry brought together but there's also this other line of latitude that we're talking about here and I don't have time to go into it right now but my friends this it's going to form a popular latitude here known as 19.5 and this is going to be our equatorial and this is going to be our polar axis this is going to be our 19.5 I don't have time to go into that right now but that should have just blown your socks off if you could see that, if we were to put that in relationship with the globe, and then we would understand that this is 19.5 degrees south latitude, and that this is 19.5 degrees north latitude. Now, I don't have time to go into that, but phew, everything's connected. So from these two Fs, I get fact and faith, which is the mirror for the two realities, the duality. Well, I told you that they represent these four dimensions, the four dimensions are being seen by the two eyes. So we get the 44. Well, when you mirror the 44 together, like the two Fs, believe it or not, we get this symbol here when they're mirrored together. So that symbol, which is one four and the other four mirrored together, they create the stairway for dominance or control and we see now that both eyes are brought together but they are flipped upside down and then the eyes are brought together both are under deception and we see that this is that avenue for control which is created by the bringing together of the two fours now if you guys think that I was able to plan this create this and orchestrate with the Bible you are sorely mistaken I planned none of this. I'm a pretty smart guy, but I am not that smart. These are things that are revealed to me and that is even revealed to me right now. I, sh I told you a few videos back that a few moments ago this was revealed to me. Well, this is exactly what you're seeing. Now you're seeing this is the two fours, okay? There's one four, the same shape. There's the other four. There's the other four, there's the other four. It stands for the four dimensions, all brought together and mirrored together against each other. But when you mirror against each other, you only see the backward reflection of the each other's view. Everything's backwards. That's how they're gonna control it. It makes a Mayan pyramid in the frontal view. Now, with all four fours together, it makes the Mayan pyramid from the overhead view. And that's what we're looking at. Here are, that's one four, same thing. We flip it upside down. We have the two opposing fours. Okay, there is a four right there. And then there's the mirror of the four. Well, that's the overhead of the Mayan pyramid. It's what you're seeing from looking at it front view right here. And now it mirrors two more fours again. You think that's by accident? You think that I went back in time and built this into the Mayan pyramids? so that I could come here and construct this and create this little video series that really nobody's really watching or interested in? <laughs> nah. Nah, that's not how it's happening. The spirit is showing me the interconnectedness and the interrelatedness of everything. Now, that is the 44, friends. I hope you understand. I'm out of here.